welcome to episode 107 of Snug Radio's Retro Lounge. This evening, well, a couple of things before we start. A couple of things. I'm not a wallpapers kind of guy, but I've just got a um, a new phone. Old one was um, getting old. Five years seems a bit old. Um, so I've got the iPhone 15, and. I found this. I don't know. I, I'm hoping it'll show. Look, look how cool. Is that? Game Boy Advance SP wallpaper. Um, and now that you can emulate a, 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 a many consoles, actually, but if you get the Delta emulator in the iPhone shop, you can uh, emulate lots of things on your iPhone. Yes. Oh, I've spent a lot of time in Delta this weekend. Um... Also this weekend, you can't see it properly that way. Look, look, look at that. Look at that. Um, basic knife safety. I should know better. I should know better. But um, earlier, Naughty Cluster was saying, don't make it an excuse for playing bad. And I say, I'm, you know, and I'm not using it as an excuse. It won't make me play any worse than I normally do. So, uh, and talking of Naughty Cluster, here she is, just arrived in the chat room. Not a moment to on time. Um, so what are we doing tonight? Well, we're going to be playing Sega Saturn games that we've never played on Retro Lounge. Now, I used to have, um, I say used to, I say used to for all these. I've still got them. Uh, I've got a couple of Sega Saturns and the guns and... All sorts of stuff. Um, but I don't remember any of these games. Which doesn't say a lot. I don't remember last week. But I don't remember a lot of these. It might We might start playing them. I'll be like, oh, I remember this. But we'll see. Um, so, I'm going to do that. I would just like to pause and say thank you, Nutty Cluster, for subs resubscribing again. You can be like Nutty Cluster. You could subscribe uh, and not get any ads. So, thank you. 15 months. Was Duck Hunt a Saturn game? No, Duck Hunt was a NES game. A couple of generations earlier than the uh, thing. I think Time, Time Crisis, Virtua Cop. I think they're probably about Saturn time um but again again these games are from the late mid to late 90s 96 97 some of the dates on here um that doesn't seem 30 odd years ago to me nearly 30 years ago um it's just one of those weird things weird things about time uh anyway let's get over to T little screen, little play screen, and then we'll um, we'll have a look at some of them, shall we? We'll get going. Boop. There we go. What? There's a gold satin controller with a lady sat on it. What can I say? Uh, the artist that created these, some of them, it's so got a picture of the console. Some of them, it's a picture of the controller. Nothing if not consistent. Um, we're going to play in alphabetical order, as always. And um, we're going to start with uh, B for Blazing Heroes. Again, I could, I could try guessing what these all are. But I'll just make a fool of myself, because I've got no freaking idea. Um, let's move the telly back underneath, shall we? No, nope, that's not the right one, is it? It's that one. There we go. I think that's probably right. Blazing Heroes, let's have a look. Yes, in the days when uh, everything had a, had a whoosh screen at the start. Right, chat room, let me know if, um, if we're too noisy or what? looked a bit 
got um, mangry, didn't he? Good old blocky 3D esque graphics. Love them. Mm. I mean, I'm still none the wiser what sort of game it is. Feels a little RPG, doesn't it? Could be just a beat the crap out of people type game. Should we press start and find out? Now, technically, I suppose I should be playing with the um, the Sega Saturn controller that I bought for this occasion. Um, I just don't like the way it feels. <laughs> so, oh, look at this story. Oh. <laughs> story and jerky graphics. Prince of Queensland. Oh no. Oi noi. So, so, the, the owl. Um, God, it's amazing how you don't think about how much you use the side of your left thumb when you're right handed. I thought it's my left thumb, I'll be fine. All day, I've been banging it on shit. And now, when you put it on their little <laughs> the buttons, it hurts. Um... So obviously it's set in Australia. And now we're gonna kick his taint, apparently. Are you saying short show tonight because of the uh, RPG game we started with or because my thumb hurts every time I press a button? So it's the introduction to everybody. Can we, can we skip that? Can we? No, nope, we have to press. Oh, he doesn't have a name, he's just Animal Warrior. Is that right? Really? Feral. Or Ferra number one, perhaps. <laughs> okay, come on then. Oh, Jesus, come on. to say on on I think it's more of a thing nowadays than than years ago but they sort of say oh this game lasts 24 hours or something you think, oh playing for 24 hours no they mean there's 20 hours of story 
and, and four hours of gameplay. Okay, so you just told us to kill him, so come on, come on. Now we're getting introduced to all the bloody bad guys. Okay, now, let's go. Oh. Chatty, chatty, chat. For Queensland. Oh, confusing as shit. Right, it's a, it's an RP, it's not an RPG. It's, or oh, it could be half RPG parts. It's an RP, it's not even real time, is it? So it's a strategy game. Did I even... Did, no. No, I want to actually move. What? How far can I move? Can I move? Here? No! Where's... Where's... I mean, I want to party. Yay, let's party. Okay, so I think I might be using... Oh. What a load of shade. Yes, yes, I'm ending my turn. I'm not moving at all. I'm just ending my turn. They can come to me. Gonna get a surprise now. Oh, cat attack. Oh, oh, all right, defend, me. defend, defend. That's it. Defend. Okay, next person. Next person, next person. No, no, come on. What are you doing? How do I end? I want to select another player. Not by doing that. Um, I agree it has an air of scratchedness about it no cluster um, but I did I, I, I want to give it a chance I think I think we might have a grasp of what buttons to press now see oh well now it's insolent pups. Oh, chatty chat chat. Come on. Is that why we're blazing heroes? Run away.
So to begin, we've got one of the bad guys. Oh, now he's a good guy. Shades of grey, you see. Ooh. Trustworthy ninja. Blah, blah, blah. All righty then, let's try again, shall we? gonna attack oh what's punch do you think it's punch or do you think he does a funny witty word related chat hmm. i hope atk was attack looks like it doesn't it <coughs> super um Come on, Reiki Duba. Can we attack somebody? <coughs> we sure we can. <coughs> Excuse me. That was my fault for not pressing the button straight away. Okay, so let's see what this bird can do. Nothing. She can defend defensiveness. Use this block back here. Let's see what we do. Uh, we can't get him anywhere either. shouldn't put him in harm's way do you reckon I'm gonna do but I perhaps shouldn't what's FRB is he attacking with a Furby perhaps let's leave him eating steak oh I can't can't do that it is then. So on the upside, at least we can kill these guys. I don't know what steak is. Well, I didn't kill him. That wasn't very good, was it? Feral, feral one. Ah, fancy. Spinning spear. So, 
this little guy's got arrow shit, which I'm taking to mean arrow shot, which means it's the after. How far can we get in the sky, maybe? Get in there. Oh, and he's dead. He's dead. Uh, right. We're going to see what this guy, how he is on the pun stakes, I think. Let me tell you one about... this lady have any magical ability to um, hold holy cur hug so I'm guessing that's something to do with healing so we're gonna find out what ferb is fireball hurrah Let's finish these guys off and then we'll call it a day. Yep, we're gonna, we're gonna stake them. Uh, can we have another go? Do we get, is it just one, one go? Yeah, just one go. Why didn't he use his new technique? He's got a new technique. Uh, little green dwarf fella. Let's, um, a real shit. Oh, and then he shot me on fella then. That would be bad. That. That's not enough. Yes, it is. Oh, he's discovered a new technique. All oh, these new techniques. Ooh. Lightning shot. Okay. It does look like my shit on the menu, but... Can I say? Um, didn't, didn't like... Didn't like pun. We're going to stick with this one. Gotta be it. Hurrah! Yep, alright. Alright, alright. Is that it? Who didn't go that time? Can't fireball that far. Oh, more reinforcements. F off. Random? Oh. Perhaps not. So, uh, let's send this little guy up that way. And we can do an arrow shit. He's dead. He's dead. Okay. I think this bloke's going to be more use up here. Ten. What's going on? We're gonna have to 
curveball this guy. the hang of how it all works and everything but it I don't know I don't know why I, I, I feel it's perhaps a little boring I, I wouldn't want to play like this for hours you know I don't think sit doing this all night and it wouldn't get us very far would it so we've got a lot of games to get through I spent 20 minutes on this one so you know let's get rid of that one for now um okay so what are we going to look at next well we're going to look at uh bug bug exclamation point uh so Let's get you that on screen. One assumes it involves um, a bug. We shall find out. Didn't even look at the options. Just went straight in. Start. And action. Okay, so it's a th 3D platformer. Oh. Right, so we've got at the moment we've just got jump. I mean, they're really, they're really going for the. Uh, hey, we we can do 3D now, people. Uh, tell you what, it takes a bit of getting used to. Just a tiny bit of getting used to. Game where we have to get them all. 
best at just in case. Bad things fall off, uh, happen if you fall off. Bad juice. I know I missed one, I know. I know. Do you know what? I don't care. Oh, what's to the left? Oops, I'm gonna I wish I'd gone that. right. Escher territory. Right, it's just a bonus area then. I don't know about you, but I can't see where any of these things are. My depth perceptions are shot. Bug juice! Bug juice. So do I have to go back? All the way back? Oh, I think I might have to. Ooh. Hey, I jumped before you got me then. I started right back at the start. Bollocks, I think I have. Watch it, buddy. So, now that I've got the, the secret stuffs, are they still there? They're, they're not. Right, so I don't need to go back up the Escher path. Should make retracing my steps a little quicker. Oh. There's another one down here, isn't there? Where is it? Jumped up. Oh! Cock. Oh, dear. Oh, shit. Didn't see him last time. Faking grass up. Bad juice. Oh, I can see the bug juice up there. But there aren't any crystals, so I'm not going to bother. It doesn't matter how careful I am here, if I end up falling off, it doesn't matter how many lives I've got left, does it? Oh, so then he jumps on one plane.
I'd have to do something to get to that one. Ah. There's a lever. Lever alone. Whoa. Woo. Didn't even jump. Didn't even jump. Didn't even jump. Okay, Mr. Hotshot Game Player, now what? I'm not going to continue it because we have a lot of games and it's irritating the shit out of me, but I do like it. Ah! I don't dislike it. How's that? Nice butt. Bet you didn't think you were going to see that tonight. Okay, um, that was Bug! So now we're going to move on to um, <clears throat> Crime Wave. Now, this is one that I thought, oh, I kind of recognise the box art, but I don't remember ever playing it uh, so let's have a look and see what it is exactly every now and again I will be eating um, jellies that are pina colada flavored um, I will keep eating noise to a minimum oh driving Driving with machine guns. Target, target. Do I have shotgun or do I have to shoot?
found me guns. It's a bit loud, is it? Sorry, is that better? Right, I've gone insane, I'm shooting everything. It's making me feel a bit car sick. Shite. Oh, well, that was weird. Oh, I'm definitely, definitely started recording and it wasn't recording. But it doesn't matter. Well, there you go. I think we've seen enough. Crime wave, don't you? It would have worked fine in one of our driving shows. Okay. I'm curious about this next one because... I added it to the list, and when I've started it just now, I noticed it said, disc one of two. And now I'm like, oh, poop. I've also seen it's got JP in brackets, which generally stands for Japan. <sighs> oh, well. Let's check out Fist. See what happens. The Japanese Sega Saturn logo. All right. This is where it might got brass up. Oh no, okay. Oh. Oh. 
polygonal a pol polygon igloo po fighting game with lots of polygons. Okay, and oh no, wrong. Okay, Ready? Oh. ouch. Go. Oh, bitch. Oh, what are my buttons? What are my buttons? Hey, hey, whoa, whoa! Stop this fight while I work on my buttons. <laughs> oh, booting face. Come on, there must be... There must be other buttons. How many buttons are there? See, there's six on the Saturn. So why do I not have punch and kick and shit? Oh, they look so comfortable, those models. Ready? Go! Right, so we've got a block. Punch you in the knees. Ooh. Punching, kicking shit, yeah. Shit's a special button, but it's only in a, in a really small number of games. <laughs> you don't see it very often. Ready? Go! Oh, she's not messing around, is she? Not just punch her in the oh, end then. She's just jumping on her on the card. Isn't she? Good blocker. And a good kicker in the face. Like that. Oh, she waited for me to come down. Do you see her looking? Take that. Party. Ooh.
Beaten by a rabbit lady. Ready? Go! I don't know how to do them ones. Right, my shoulder buttons don't seem to do anything, so... Ooh! How did I do that? Do with that, do that more often. Oh. God, is she dead? Look, she's laying there with the diaries. Got... I don't think we need to continue this, do we? It's hitting my thumb. <laughs> uh, fist! Two people there, fisting. Uh... What a sound effect. Uh, there you go. I think we need to uh, do any more of that. So, uh, another weird title that I feel may have some Japanese influence. Um, Gals Panic SS. I, 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 no idea. No, no idea to ask it. It's never a good sign. Start with the one that's there. Hmm. I pressed the wrong thing. The buttons are in slightly different place. Okay. What are we doing? Oh. Move off there. Right, so I have to press a button to move. Oh, and not get touched by the spinning balloon people. Oh. So I feel we've played a game a bit like this on, um, I can't remember what it was. But we had to drop it, we had to draw shapes and avoid things. Oh, shit. Right, so I can't go back. There's no way of avoiding them then, by the looks of it. So... So I might have to be back on my line by the time that they come back.
Ja, glaube ich. Um, I mean, on the upside, she's got a close up. Oh, not sure why she's a different finger like that. It says continue, but it's not continued me at all. Oh! So, yes, as long as I'm... As long as I'm on the line when it says danger, I should be fine, should I? Yes, okay. them all in one area. Not sure if that's possible. <laughs> Hurry up, what are you talking about, stupid? Hurry up. Oh. We'll try a different person and see if it makes different difference to the game. I think it probably only make a difference to the girl sat behind. The I don't want to go that far. That was shit, wasn't it? them in into their own little sections. Although I'm gonna get a hurry up in a minute I'm sure of it. Oh Oh why did I do a diagonal? Welcome to my, my uh, welcome to. See, I'm always complaining about you doing a diagonal. You know, you never you believe me. See, the only problem is now is it's going to be even more difficult to get these guys. Oh my 
be snap. Okay, 80% is all you need, is it? Okay. about the danger, Will Robinson, danger. Oh well, that was Gal's Panic SS. Which has unfortunate connotations. Um, okay, so then let's try Crazy Ivan. Or Ivan. If you prefer. Um... It's only because I have a friend called Ivan that I pronounce it that way. I'm sure it's supposed to be pronounced Ivan. Like Ivan the Terrible. Ooh. Well, that's not the screen you need, is it? It's that one. Okay, okay, okay. That's very true, uh, Naughty Cluster. It could be terrible, in which case we'll call it. Call it Ivan the Terrible. Jumpy as a jackrabbit. Chip is getting on my nerves. Sounds like he's having a party. Do you know why they call him Crazy Ivan? Don't tell me. Well, they pronounced it Ivan. Oh, very fun. You heard of the Gorbachev Day Massacre? Of course. You mean he's that Ivan? But he's completely unstable. <laughs> Free job! Yes, Commander. I've been cooped up in this sardine can for seven hours now. I'm bored. Our ETA at launch coordinates is... Now, that's uh, close enough. Initialize launch procedure. You can't do that, Commander. Oh? The transporter is not stabilized. The blast shields are not up. That's enough. Launching now. Hit the brakes. Now you see why I'm nervous. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Thanks. It's good job Nutty Cluster's here. Yes, ignition. He's too well. You're not missing a massive amount, but thank you for letting me know. You have 15 seconds to achieve takeoff mode. And get the shields up. You are crazy. Stabilizers, no. There isn't time. <laughs> crazy, they say. Post-traumatic stress, they say. Stabilizers, down. Raising launch tube. It's too late. We're toast. Launch tube in position. Shields. The cabin shields. Bingo.
nostalgic world of full motion video. Yes, that's right, I press the button. I press start. I think it thinks it's loading a disc. Have we killed it? I just restarted that just in case I killed it. We're not going to watch the film again. At least I hope we're not. I hope there's a way of skipping it. This is about where I pressed the button and screwed it up the last time. Let me see. What was that? Is that a bad guy, do you reckon? Should we go and get dwarf? Oh, we can't get dwarf. What? what? This is dwarf. He's slow, but packs a real punch. Try for a headshot and keep moving. Do we? Do, do we? Do we have it on the map? Can we see where we're supposed to be going? Oh, is it the blue? Am I supposed to be heading towards the blue? Whatever these are. Congratulations. That was some nice shooting. Thank you.
controls have gone in for some reason. I've pressed the button and switched. Not a fan. I was crazy, Ivan. Let's move on, shall we? Let's let's move on. Um, in fact, we should move on. Look at the time. Bloody hell. Uh, okay, so we're going to move on. We're in the S's now, and we're going to go to 1997's Scorcher. Um, and now we've moved the screen around it's it's all different oh no we can't have it any higher let's see what that does Scorch you It's a race. You know how I feel about racing. Well, I need sort of driving. Prepare to race in the dump. What the actual... So we've got a jump. Don't know any of the other buttons do. Oh, oh, don't like that. Oh. Oh, I can't. Go down there. I'm supposed to go down there. Why have I stopped? I'm not practicing the accelerator. Interesting. What a weird concept. Uh, let's try it again with the concept of um, acceleration, shall we? Right, drop you back to the start. Now they all left before that was a race. Oh! Oh! Is 
good luck with me. Any good racing game, I came last. Don't think there's an awful lot more to see of that one, is there? Look, even when you... It's not like a, yay, move on to the next lap or anything like that. Wow. We spent 23 minutes playing Blazing Heroes. And we've spent... Four minutes, five minutes of playing Scorcher. It does seem that we get less and less as, as the games, like, super enthusiastic with the first couple of games. And then as we get further down the list, if they're not great, you know, I don't, I don't give them a lot of a chance. Uh, but that was Scorcher. Um, this next one I've put on because I'm just curious. It, 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 was it still a thing when the um, when the Saturn was out? This is this is Space Invaders, and I just want to see what we were doing with Space Invaders in the nineties. Oh, it's actually... Oh, I see. Thought it's just a collection of different... Is that it? Oh, ouch, ouch. Well... Let's play the big daddy of them all, shall we? Just have a quick go. Oh, arcade accurate um, text fonts and stuff like that. The background's not homes. Okay. So so how do we start then? You know, perhaps we're not perhaps we're not playing it. think it'd be as easy as that when you just just press play do we need to put a coin in these are for all the different overlays they used to have so what have we got I mean, the start button looks like it should be start. It's got start written on it. It's mentioning a Z button. I don't have a Z button on this pad. But there is a Z button on that pad. So maybe that's why I can't play it. Well, I can't be asked trying to get it to work. You've seen Space Invaders. We've done a whole show on it. You don't need to see it again. I just had to see what what they were selling us on the game, uh, on the Sega Saturn. That's what we're playing, Sega Saturn. Ooh. Right, let's move on. Let's move on. 
see that game we played even less than five minutes. Um, we're going to move to a game called Trash It. Trash It. Oh, a bigger screen. What's going on? Um, if I shrink it for me... Well, it's too small for you now. See how we get on with that. I think it was one of Salt and Pepper's lesser songs, maybe. No, I'm not going to sing it. Well, that's a drum beat of its time, isn't it? Wow. And now, ladies and gentlemen, come to you live and Why is this early rage? Okay. How many more title screens are we going to have? Yes, I'll go with English. So, let's just press start and shall we and see what we're doing. Play the art. There's just, just one play. Oh, oh, hang on. You can't play it. Single player. Oh, no. Let's go back then. Really, you spent all that time just writing Get Ready. Oh, game. Game, game, game. Do I need to press start? Game. Yeah, yeah, it's scratched. It's scratched. Oh no. 
Oh no. Scratchy scratched. Um So our last our last game now then is a game called Whiz. Whiz. Oh, that's not a good start, is it? I can't see anything on the screen. Can't hear anything either. Oh! Why can't I see anything? I see a little green dot in the top left. Let's do a quick restart. Okay. I didn't do that out of uh, annoyment. Annoyment? Annoyance. <laughs> uh, um, it's broken it. What an anticlimax. But these things happen. These things happen when you're broadcasting live. I will remove it from the list. It will not go on the show notes. You will not um, be seeing Wiz 1996. Um, instead, what we're going to do is say, that's it, that's it for tonight. But boy, oh boy, look at the wheel. Holy moly. Um, now, I could could go through it all and describe everything to you, uh, but it's mostly self-explanatory. Uh, the, the things, we've got a lot of unplayed Game. We have many, many unplayed games. We could just do unplayed games for the rest of the decade and we'd still have games left. But we've put stuff back on the wheel and um, it's, like I say, for some reason we'd not put unplayed GameCube and unplayed N64 and they were missing. So they're back on, they're on. They're new. They're on. We've got... So I've put Mario-related and Sonic-related. So rather than games that have just got Sonic in, or Mario, we're going with games that are set in the universe that that have may have characters based on those games, you know? So we've got those two. Um, what else is new? Lost in Translation. Um, I've got a lot of translated Japanese games that um, we may do or we may just I mean this is just a, 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 a section to make it more difficult for me um, we'll be playing Japanese games with translations if we can we've got time travel on there games involving time travel or some sort of time manipulation monkeys we've got games with monkey in the title so so yeah we're, we're we're all up to date now so um shall we spin it and see what we're doing next week some of the most some of the eagle eyed ones on this tube you'll notice two of the slots bigger than the other ones unplayed mega drive ah we did that not so long ago didn't we so when did we do that Oh, oh no, okay. We have not done it in the past few months. There you go. So uh, what I was going to say was um, there's two. There are slightly bigger. There's arcade collections, and that was on the wheel before we refilled it, and Mod's Choice. She's not had a Mod's Choice for a while. Um, so... We've made that a, a bigger slot, twice as big, so it's got more of a chance of being picked. But next week, unplayed Mega Drive. So that is kind of, that's kind of um, a mod's choice because she does like a Mega Drive games. So, um, okay, well, well, interesting. 
been updating some of my uh, Mega Drive games, so I'll be curious to see what we fancy playing next week. Um, but that's it for this week. Ah, the Sega Saturn. I think I may have just spoilt my nostalgia for it. Um, oh, some some rough choices this week. Some good ones, but some rough choices. Um, if you have a favourite email, uh, not an email, a favourite <laughs> Sega Saturn game, and you want to email it us and let us know, uh, we can add it on next time we get unplayed Sega Saturn. Uh, the email is just there, stugradio at... It's been one of those nights, hasn't it? My thumbs are in... I'm just feeling out of sorts. It's retro. Retro. Name of the show in the email. Retro at snugradio.co.uk. Retro at snugradio.co.uk. <sighs> snugradio.co.uk is the name of the website. Um, but if you're watching us uh, live on Twitch on a Monday at 7 o'clock, then you know we're on Twitch as Snug Radio. And if you're watching us on YouTube, then we're on Twitch live at seven o'clock. This, this that you're watching now, this is the super hyper polished version. Yeah, I know, right? This is <laughs> this is the edited version. Uh, if you're watching it on YouTube, and you can join us live on a Monday night on Twitch. Um, we're also we're also on uh, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, all those places as Snug Radio. Um, so you can join us there and catch up with what we're doing. Uh, we also have a Discord server. The link will be in the show notes, wherever you get in the video. And um, I think that's about it. Show-related, uh, not kind of show-related, uh, Nutty Cluster, who's been uh, monitoring the chat room all show. When she's not doing that, um, when she's not being ill, she has a design shop. Um, and you YouTube people, you'll be able to see her design logo just appear here. It's called Inkyspiration, um, where you can find all sorts of cool designs and a whole host of Taskmaster merch. Um, so, yeah, head on over. Buy it, buy something nice for yourself. Um, and that's Inkyspiration at Redbubble. But like I say, I've done the work for you. There'll be a link in the show notes. Um, and now, if you look there, you YouTube people, you'll see uh, my design shop, which is the glorious idiot. I'm on the I'm on Redbubble and on Threadless. Um, also, cool stuff. Nutty Cluster bought um, a, a, a phone case from my store of one of my Hawaiian prints, and golly, it looks great. I'm not just saying that. It looks really good. Um, so that's The Glorious Idiot on Redbubble and Threadless. Uh, link in the show notes. So um, that's it for this week. Um, don't forget to join us next week. Till next time, I've been Matt. This has been Sub Radio's Retro Lounge. Play something retro. Bye.